Good morning. I'm trying to get my fire started. It's a little hot. Don't want to burn my tarp again. Last night I burned a little bitty pinhole in my brand new tent. So hopefully I won't today. I hope that filming last night uh, was okay. It probably still looks dark. It'll be daylight in just a minute. It's a. Uh, it's 5:30 and the temperature 66 degrees, which it was 63 before I started the fire. So I guess that's three degrees difference. I guess that's why my camera's overheating. I need to keep it pushed back. I just wanted to get the fire going, get some coals going. Uh, give me some coffee going here. Put some more water in this thing. And then, because uh, I ain't going to be able to stay a long time this morning because I got to keep the babies. So I got to get back up there and do my babysitting job. Let's see. Put me a little, whoop. Got a grand egg long leg or something on my. gonna cook some more eggs this morning y'all know how much I like them but I don't have any jalapenos it was too hot they would have run anyway I had a little bit of ice on a little thing I had the eggs on so maybe they'll be okay I'm just gonna set that right on the edge all right I'm gonna let this heat up and uh as it's getting daylight we'll start filming a little bit more. Get some coffee my water was boiling so Oh yeah. I'm gonna leave that over this morning so you can see it. Whoop. Mmm. That's good stuff. leave it sitting there like that so that uh, when I get breakfast started in a minute it's uh 5:45. it says it'll be uh, breaking it's breaking daylight now you just can't tell with the camera so anyway cut the bacon up using Charlie's knife Cut the Polish sausage. Wish I had jalapenos. I really like this knife. Anyway, we're gonna put these in the skillet in a minute. I got an egg. But uh, I got them cut up, so we'll go ahead and put these in there. I love this cutting board. Easy. Go on in there, boys. I dropped one. I don't want to drop another one. Okay. Put that egg in there, too, here in a minute, and we'll get started. I'm going to cover it up, though, with my hanky and on my handkerchief until... Uh, Gets at least a little bit more daylight. Oh. 
this is my uh I put that compass and all on there uh I found out when the blades in there it uh <laughs> it don't work right so you got to pull the blade out to use it but uh uh you know because it throws the compass off with right up the next to the metal like that but I like this thing and especially the knife and the the scalpel and all man this thing's cool I like that little uh, squirrel cooker I got. It works pretty good. Pretty fatty bacon I got this morning. But it's making me some good grease for my eggs anyway. I don't know if I told y'all, but I burned a hole in my tarp last night. It's just a tiny, tiny, tiny pinhole. I guess a, a spark went up and got on it. I'm gonna have to uh, read up how to patch it. I guess I could put a, just a piece of duct tape on the top and bottom, a small piece, but I wanna do it right. So I'm gonna do some research. And probably use some, maybe some silicone, like, like seam seal stuff, and maybe put on a, like an old, another piece of material. I hate to stitch it, but I'll read it. I think you can just buy some stuff that'll just glue on it. Cause I mean, it's it's like this an ink pen tip. It's tiny. I'm just gonna leave it in there. Put the egg over here on the side. My goodness gracious. Blooper. Okay, it's not gonna be no egg this morning. I got a little bit of egg in there, but not much. Most of it got on the ground. So. But it's gonna be good. It's gonna have egg flavor. <laughs> Okay, it's gonna be good stuff. It's got it's got a little bit of egg flavor over here on the side, but uh, got some bacon. That one's kind of fatty there, but uh, this other is pretty good. But uh, it's gonna be good. Not a big breakfast, but it's gonna be a good breakfast. Got my coffee. Oh, I'm gonna put some red-eyed hog on there, and I'm probably gonna put some Texas Pete. After it cools off a little bit, I'm gonna put some Texas peat on it. Here's my coffee. It's probably just right now. Uh, okay, still ain't as daylight as I want it to be, but. I got coffee. I got me some eggs and uh, it's gonna be good. I'm gonna put me some Texas peat on here. Tell you something cool, last night when I was, after I was getting ready to go to bed, I posted some pictures to let everybody know I was camping out and um, Carolina Chris responded to me showing me a video of, of his tent, his one tiger's tent. And um, that was, that's just too cool for those guys. You know, they got all those subscribers and all, and he, he responded and talked to me. I thought that was kind of cool. Just this little old creek camper down here in Alabama. But anyway, uh, I appreciate that, man. He's a, he's a good guy. He's a, 
he's just down to earth, not too busy to talk to uh, his subscribers and people that respond to him and stuff. He's a he's a good guy. Man, I turned my flashlight on and got it shining on me. I'm, it's about 10 after 6, and I got to be up there to take care of my grandbabies at 7, but I could leave all this up, but I don't I don't like to do that. I'm going to take it all down, but I, I squeeze in. I get through keeping them about uh, about 3 every day, sometimes 4. So uh, I got plenty of time in the evenings, but uh, in the mornings I'm in a hurry. But I could leave it and get it up this afternoon. Because I'm not far from the house. But uh, I'll probably just get it up. So I'm cheating. I got my flashlight right here. But as you can see, it's, I can see now. I can see 200 yards. It's just for filming, it's not that good. Mmm. Man, this is good. I don't want to bore y'all sitting here eating. Uh, I know normally I have my quiet time. And if I have time, I will a little bit, but I usually do that now during the week when the kids are napping. Or I usually do it now when I get up before they get here, but so I got to squeeze it in today. Uh, probably when they, they take a nap every morning about 8.30, so I can do that. It's a beautiful day, though, and um, it got down to 62 or 63. When I started the fire, it went back up to like 65 or 66 or something. So I took a picture of it at, I think, 63. So I'll show that. But uh, anyway, I'm going to finish this breakfast and break down the tent. And I might have some quiet time if I've got time. But, it, you know, I won't really get to do much, have time to do much. So, man, this breakfast is delicious, though. I got a little bamboo fork that I got. I got this at Apalachicola when I got that little uh, tone spatula. It's good. Mmm. Ooh, that smoke's getting me this morning. It wasn't as bad last night. Mmm. I usually don't eat on the camera, but dang, that's good. Thanks for watching my video. And, um, you know, if you like, you know, get people, you know, with stuff outdoors and all like this, uh, you know, and you like watching it, you know, you might want to hit the subscribe button. You know, if you don't, uh, you know, you can just, and the notifications button will tell you when I'm putting out another video. I try to put out a video at least every Saturday. <clears throat> I think for like almost a year. I think September, sometime in September, I have had a YouTube channel for a year. Not quite a year yet, but it's almost a year. But uh, I remember at the Penhody Fest, which is coming up in about a week or two in, in uh, Sylacauga, all, it's a big Penhody trail. Uh, the Penhody Outdoor Center and all sponsors it and all kind of hikers and a lot of them YouTube hikers that does the Triple Crown and all, they'll all be there. And um, I went last year and we really enjoyed, me and Rhonda went down there and spent a Saturday. But you can go down there and camp out in the field next to it for free if you if you like that too. But it's just close enough for me to drive. <clears throat> but uh, that's when I started my channel was that. Rhonda seen a guy with the, with a GoPro and um, she ordered it because I've been filming with my phone down at my cabin. But, uh, anyway. So, uh, you know, if you like this kind of stuff, hit that subscribe button. And um, anyway, remember what I always say. Uh, keep God first. You know, you know, it just, it makes things better. I ain't gonna say everything's perfect because, you know, we, this is life. We're living life. But we ain't got, uh, you keep God first, it, it just makes everything better uh, than it could be. But anyway, thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button if you can and a uh, creek camper out.
Israel.